Afghanistan is a country that engineering and there is mostly for the men. In 2017, I joined the robotics team. It was the first robotics team, and also we were all girls in this team. From 2017 up to now, we built many robots for solving the problems in our community. In 2020, in pandemic time, we built a ventilator because in Afghanistan there was a rare number of the ventilator and I was the lead of the team, so I became one of the 100 influential and inspirational women of 2020 from BBC. Then Taliban, they captured the Herat city. So our team, we had to move to the Kabul city, which is the capital of the Afghanistan. But suddenly we noticed that the Taliban are near to the Kabul city as well. There were like thousands of people that they were running, entered the airport. Our team, we heard the sound of the shouting, uh, in the street um, from Taliban, from foreign armies, there was some dead bodies on the street. Also there were some children that they were just shouting their parents' names because they lost them. Uh, in two days, there was the most hard times in my life. Fortunately, the Qatar government helped us. We entered to the airport. We came out from Afghanistan and we went to Qatar. So for 11 months, we were in Qatar. Qatar government, Qatar uh, Foundation, and Qatar Fund for Development, they really help us a lot in this time. They provide us the dorm, they provide us a scholarship for our college. So I was looking for a university that was focused in engineering and technology. So I searched about the Missouri and team, their website, and I saw many videos in the YouTube, and also the Instagram page of the Missouri and I noticed that there is the place that I wanted to go. When I came in here, I feel that everything is okay. It's like my home. The environment is so friendly. The staff, they help me a lot to settle in here. I'm trying to use all my energy to learn about everything from here, to take part in many design teams. There was many different good projects. The race car, the rocket team. There is a team by the name of Engineers Without Borders. This is a team that I want to grow and join them because they went in a countries which are like my country, a country that they don't have facilities. And so they go and they help that people. I also wanted to help people. So that team I think is the best thing for me. I have three different goals. The first one is to be a successful mechanical engineer. The second one, to be a woman activist and to be the voice of the women and girls who are in Afghanistan. And the third one, I want to be a mentor in the engineering school that we are going to build in Afghanistan.